going on everybody my name's connor you guys can call me superior and today on july 28th 2016 as i'm sure a lot of you guys already know if you've been following my channel treyarch added a shit ton of new guns to call the black ops 3 a ton of them and here's the thing normally when they add guns they had a lot of useless ones, mostly melee weapons like a carver, the baseball bat, that aren't really that good. But in this update, they actually added good guns. They added the DSR-50, and in this gameplay, it's my boy Doom FIFA Kill. He's actually using the Peacekeeper. All right, now the Peacekeeper was actually in Call of Duty Black Ops 2, and they decided to bring it back into Black Ops 3. Which is dope, because the Peacekeeper was fun, and it was a great gun. However... This is kind of where I have my few complaints about how they brought the Peacekeeper back to Black Ops 3. In Black Ops 2, all you needed to do to get the Peacekeeper was buy the gun. I think it was like 3 or $4. Like, literally, you pay Treyarch $3, boom, they give you the Peacekeeper. But in Black Ops 3, if you pay like $4, you get to open two supply drops, which you... I can almost guarantee if you open two supply drops, you're not going to get the Peacekeeper because they added it to supply drops. You need to buy way more COD points, and it's stupid. Personally, I think it's stupid how they brought the Peacekeeper back. Like, in Black Ops 2, the gun was like $3. And in this game, if you spend $3 trying to get the Peacekeeper, you're probably not going to get it. So that's kind of bullshit. That's stupid. And if you don't have the Peacekeeper, then, you know, obviously, you're, you're probably pretty upset, just like me, that it's like that. Now, anyway, the gameplay you're watching was one of the world's first nuclears with the Peacekeeper. Literally, Doom FIFA Kill, in this gameplay that you're watching, first supply drop he opens, he gets the fucking Peacekeeper. Second game he plays, he gets a nuclear. So, literally, I'm not 100% sure, but I'd almost go so far to say that this is the world's first nuclear ever with the peacekeeper mark 2 which is just fucking insane so huge shout out to my boy doom fifa kill i'll link his channel down in the description go check him out he always is posting crazy gameplays if you guys do enjoy this insane nuclear hit the thumbs up button i would show you guys the class setup he was using in this gameplay but i don't want to do that just because it was only his second game playing with the peacekeeper uh, which means he's not going to have a whole lot of attachments and stuff. You know what I mean? So I definitely think there are better class setups. And I'm sure he would agree with me than the ones he was actually using in this gameplay. But since he didn't have any more attachments unlocked or anything like that, he wasn't able to actually make a better class setup for the Peacekeeper. I want you guys to do me a huge favor. And I want you to comment two things. One, tell me what your favorite gun that they added to Call of Duty Black Ops 3 today was. If it's the DSR that they brought back from Black Ops 2, that's now a two-shot semi-auto gun. Is it the Peacekeeper? Or what is it? You know, they even added a pair of nunchucks, which is actually pretty dope. I didn't think they'd ever bring something like that to Call of Duty, but that was pretty cool. So definitely, I want you to comment down what is your favorite. I want to comment down below what guns you've gotten. Have you gotten the DSR or anything like that? Personally, I've opened about $60 of supply drops since the gun came out. And the only gun I have is the DSR-50. I'm going to be live streaming a little later tonight, and I'm going to do a huge supply drop opening. I'm going to spend a couple hundred dollars on supply drops. So definitely be on the lookout for that later on today. Hope you guys did enjoy this insane fucking nuclear with the brand new Peacekeeper. If you did, hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And have a great day, everybody. I promise more content on the new guns coming to the channel soon. Have a great day. Peace out.